Anyone else feel like playing? Robin, dude, you didn't read the instruction manual, and you even skipped the practice level. How do you do Just it? Just follow my lead. Double. Yes, I think I got you. Tiger style attack. <laughs> Cobra style strike. Frog style kick. Okay, Beast Boy. How about a crane style finishing move? Duck. Uh, that was a crane. Don't you know your bird, cyborg? No. I know a word of letters. Three. Add one letter to it, and none there will be. What is the word? Duck! Ah! Dude, how, how could you shoot me like that? Where did our love go? I gave you fair warning. Besides, we're playing solo mode, BB. That means free for all fight. Ah, <sighs> I told you guys we stood a better chance against the Ninja Onslaught if we worked together as a team, but no. Sp speaking of Ninja Onslaught. Get him! Okay, now we need to bring the teamwork. Teamwork, people! No, we can't regroup and attack together now. Every Titan for himself! Two mini ninjas. Fight solo or fight as a team? Which is it? Make up your mind! Does it really matter? You'll probably just blow us all up anyway! Raven and I perceived the sound of a young female in distress. Starfire means we heard a girly scream. That was low score, lad, over here. I'll teach you to school in my ear. Hey, I would have done better if you hadn't shot me, dude. Yeah, right. I was so close to beating the high score before you two came along. Yeah, all this over a dumb video game? I think this calls for what an earthly custom is known as... The Starfire, group hug! I hope this is accomplishing what you want it to. Oddly enough, the warm and fuzzy feeling I have inside is fading fast. I'd almost rather be playing that video game. Why are we watching the Teen Titans play a video game? It's all part of my plan, Ape Face. Super Ninja Fury? is not just some cool multiplayer online fighting game. It's an ingenious program that I wrote to record and analyze the Teen Titans fighting moves. My program will tell me how the scrum buffers battle, how they think, if they'll punch or they'll kick, if they'll zig or they'll zag. The more those pit sniffers play the game, the more cheat codes I get to use against them. <laughs> You know, there's no I in Team Gizmo. But there's a me. As in, who's gonna single-handedly take down the Teen Titans, leaving Jinx with nothing to do but tease her hair? Me. That's who. Pudleys. Not even. Tell him, Mammoth. I'll get the high score this time. Ha! Not if I get to those Super Zeros first. Sounds like a challenge to me. Last one there is a virtual loser. Azerath, Metrion, Zinthos, Azerath, I shall get it! Zinthos, Azerath, Metrion, Zinthos. We supervillains are about to wreak havoc on downtown Jump City. So you superheroes might want to come out here and stop us or something. Titans, go! Where'd they take off? Two! Ten points for Trash and the Tin Man. 
Stay still so I can score some hit points, you cowardly lion! How many points for scrounging the scarecrow, Dorothy, and her little dog, too? Beast Boy needs help! Does everyone from your planet look as good, but aim as bad as yes. you? Yo, Geekmo! Leave Star alone, or else! Or else what, Booger Boy? You'll... oh, I don't know... chase me? How predictable! <laughs> Who wants to play kick the can? I do, I do! <laughs> oh. Now what was that for? That was for my friend, Sai. Who's Cy. this lame toy for? Looks broken to me. Maybe the batteries are dead. Nope. Seems to be working just fine. Thanks for watching my back, Robbie. What the? Whoa, close. Call. S sorry, I couldn't see where I was going. Thanks to my genius program, I knew he was gonna zig when he shoulda zag. That's at least 20 more points for points. me. Points? This is some kind of game to you? Well, this game is ah! almost over. Raven? <laughs> they should call you chicken. Come out here and fight like a woman. I need some points. Can't let Gizmo beat me. Ah! Huh. Hey, where'd that witch go? Huh? Azerath Metrion. Zenthos. She is right here alongside her teammates. <clears throat> My apologies, Mr. Slade. This demonstration of our new plan to take down the Teen Titans didn't exactly go as... Uh, planned. Perhaps there was a slight glitch in the programming, and the Titans' simulated power levels were set a little too no, high, so... it was no programming glitch, head mistress. On the contrary, Gizmo's gadgets were all well built. His Teen Titan replicas were fascinating in their appearance and fighting style. They talked like the real titans, walked like the real titans, and defeated them like the real titans. They protected each other, like the real titans always do. They worked as a team, like the real titans always do. And they defeated you, like the real titans Enough always do. It's time to get more realistic. Try a little more cooperation and less competition amongst yourselves. That was your glitch. Think of it like combat training. Playing this game can improve your hand-eye coordination, reflexes, and we can even practice our teamwork. If you say so, I'm only doing this to avoid being hugged again. Yay! Look at you two kicking the butt! Stop hogging the game. It's my turn already. There's no mind team, kid. And the team that plays together stays together. But there's no hugging in Super Ninja Fury. The answer to the riddle on page 5 is 1. Hope you enjoyed our first issue. Booyah! Why must the cable present such fearsome programming? This movie's not so scary. <laughs> Commercial's over! We now return to our Fright Night Creature feature, The Attack from Outer Space.
What the heck was that? Attack from outer space! <laughs> gotcha! How do you spell UFO? Yes, we are finally here. So stop asking me, are we here yet already? Okay, but where is here? The planet Earth. However, my senses are picking up far more advanced life forms than our database indicated. That is because someone keeps forgetting to download the software and information upgrades for the ship's computer. But never mind that. What does the list say we are to bring back from here for our wealthy clients soon? The list says we are on the world of the creature called the Dodo. Ah yes, the Dodo. Pretty bird, but surely a deadly one too. Luckily, I have an ingenious plan to make catching the dodo a lot easier. Oh, Starfire, I have a present for you. Uh, a present for me? But what is the occasion? It is still 119 Earth weeks before my star day. And the UPO Harvest Festival was last month. So or is it a holiday of your people that you wish me to help celebrate? Uh, something like that. Here. This coupon entitles you to buy me one pizza free. Pizza and free? What a delicious combination! Oh uh, yeah, something like that. But you'll have to hurry. The coupon expires in like 10 minutes. Then I shall make my way to the place of pizza faster than a Tamaranian episode to a singing nectar boosh. <laughs> Beast Boy, it is I, Starfire. I am at the place of pizza, and a behind-the-counter person is saying there is no such thing as a buy-me-one pizza, and that there is also no free here. Read it again, Star. It's free for me. Because the coupon entitles you to buy me one pizza. Get it? <laughs> I get it now. Gotcha! Make it a large vegetarian, with double mushroom and eggplant. Oh, plus extra soy cheese, please. They attack from outer space! Are you sure this is not a dodo? Close. But no. Bah! This is useless! I see not a single dodo here. What key does not fit in a keyhole? A monkey! There's a good plan, sir. Sealing a dodo already in captivity. But it seems we will have to hunt it down in its natural habitat. But we are wasting time here. Back to the ship. The captain wants us to return to the ship. You remind me of my mother. I shall miss you the most. Wait a minute. My senses are picking up something. But it's not a dodo. You will not believe this. It's a different creature from the list. What is it? A Tamaranian female. <laughs> gotcha. It wasn't funny the first, second, or third time either. Oh yeah! This round's mine! That's crazy talk. And that's the alarm. Robin! Cyborg! Get to the garage, quick! Sounds like an intruder alert. What do you think? Dr. Light? Triton? Or those Hive Academy losers again? Whoever it is, I think they're in for some serious butt kicking. We're here, BB. Guys, I need you in Cyborg's room. Hurry! Oh no, they're further inside the tower! And in for a further butt kicking on top of whatever BB's dishing out. Alright, whoever you are, you better not be messing with my. Now, where did you go? The gym, dudes! The gym! Ah! The gym? What's Beast Boy doing? Giving them a tour of the place? I'll give them a tour of my foot when I kick their butts. Beast Boy? Hello? Look. Aw, oh, no, he didn't! Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Come on, where's your sense of humor? 
It's true what they say. Comedy is hard. Beast Boy! Finally! Here comes Star with my pizza! Goldani and Bounty Hunters! Help me! Ah! They attack from outer space! Don't let them touch my pizza, Star! I'll go get the others! Guys! Get out here! We're under attack! Azeroth, Metreons, yeah, right. Imagine us finding a Tamaridian on Earth. You have just made our job much easier. Our client will pay handsomely to add the likes of you to his private zoo. Stand back or I will shoot! My pizza! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Ooh, I almost lost you. I better get Sai and Robbie while Star holds them off. Look who's at it again. That boy can cry wolf or crow all he wants. I ain't hearing it. Yeah, ignore him, dude. But you gotta hear this new song. Stop that, you two. We came to this planet to find a dodo, not play tourists. Help us bring the girl in so we can move on to the dodo hunt. What? Those dumb dumbs are looking for a dodo? That bird's been extinct for hundreds of years. But if it's a dodo they want... Huh? Sir, my senses are picking up. There it is! The dodo! Detain that dodo! Now is my chance! That wasn't funny either, BB. Hey, you're not Beast Boy! Look! Up there! The attack from outer space! I came to tell you to look out the window. But I see you've already met our visitors. Yeah, and with the introductions out of the way, there's only one thing left to say. Titans, go! <laughs> Do not forget this one! Let's preserve this moment in a picture, so these spaced invaders won't forget what happens when you mess with the Titans. So you erased an awful list of creatures they wanted to capture. But exactly how are you sending them back where they came from? Simple. I just hacked into ship's outdated computer, overrode the navigational system, took some coordinates, plotted a course in the opposite direction, and hit autopilot. And they're out of here. Gone the way of the dodo. Man, look at this mess. It'll take days to clean it up. I don't know why I even have to help with any of this. It's not like you guys came rushing to help me rescue Star. If you just made it out there faster, maybe none of this would have even happened. Didn't you hear me banging on the door? Or see me trying to get your attention at the window? What's a guy gotta do for a little backup around here? If those two weren't so busy playing Super Ninja Fury, and you weren't locked up in your room doing whatever you do in gotcha. there... Jeez, can anyone take a joke around here? 